All right, guys, it's uh, time I did a review on uh, this. Now, excuse all the muck, uh, I'm back to work now and <laughs> my work is a bit on the mucky side. Sorry for the, uh, the horn sounds and you might get a bike again in a little while. But uh, this is for the uh, <coughs> Crescent uh, cup holder charger. It's gone a bit mucky, it's been working away and what have you. And you can see that we've got uh, all these ports on here. So you've got like two uh, the old cigarette lighter ports there and three USBs and if I plug that in there and we'll put that down there and I plug in to a cigarette lighter and you can see we get a little can you see that from there Just, uh, you can see there is a little blue LED it's tiny I'm not sure if you can see it from now I've got the cable all tucked in actually sort of underneath the console and that you know, and I, th I thought I'd sort of show you it in operation and what have you, stuff like that. So, if I get my charger here, uh, charge lead, should I say, if we plug that into, when I get it the right way, and the cable allows me, and plug that in there, and that into there, and that's my iPhone 6 Plus charging. So, uh, the only thing I haven't got here handy at the minute, because it's in use by the wife, is um, her iPad Pro, which uh, she's got some stuff that she's got to get done at the minute, so unfortunately. And all of these work exactly the same way, they're all the same sort of output and stuff like that. And if I plug that one in there now, and that into there, and you can see now in the top corner there you can see the iPad is charging. This is an iPad Air, uh, first generation iPad Air. So as you can see it all works great. Um, I mean I can even, if I was to take that and put that in there and you can see the blue lights come on on that. I think you can see it from there anyway. I should have. Uh, no I haven't got it with me. Well, well I'm not sure where that's gone. I'll tell you what I'll do, so if I change that over to there and we'll plug that in there. No, I won't. What I'll do is I'll plug the phone into there, it's easier to show you then. And in there, and there you go, you see the charge come on there. And <coughs> everything just works great on it. Um, I haven't had it absolutely fully banged up. Um, I just haven't had the need to. Uh, that's the thing, you know. I mean, five, five things on there, and you know, I don't, I don't carry kids anymore, particularly. So, you know, we don't need all that power. But if you've got kids, go on long journeys, stuff like that. This is ideal. Something like this. Um, you know. So, I mean, that's you know, your positives are obvious. You know, uh, it comes with a very long cable, which I've got sort of like well tucked in at the moment, so it's difficult to pull out and show you. But from that point of view, you know, you could, I mean, I've got another one of those here, which I've still got to do a review on. You know, that's got four ports in it. You know, um, obviously you need to be wary of your car's battery guys and stuff like that. You know, that's a very important point with these sort of things. I think the main negative about this one, um, it could do with a bit of a rethink, mainly on the cable. If I just undo that and I'll slide some of it out so we can see it and what you can see is it's one of these twin wires you know like the old speaker wire and it's just this stuff gets so stiff in the cold and at this time of year it is getting very stiff as you can see and that is going to snap there's no two ways about it that is going to snap especially at this point here I mean you can see that's already got quite a steep bend in it. I think what I'd like, I think the only thing I could say to this firm is think about this cable more than anything else. This this part is great. Um, other than I'd like to see that plugged in at the side. So if that had a, a side plug there and then they turn that into one of those 90 degree plugs <clears throat> so that the cable comes out that way then I think uh, they would have it pretty much spot on. Either that or just go with a, a much higher quality of flex there but even then it is eventually going to snap you know uh, that's just the nature of things but other than that an absolutely great product 
fits my cup holder fine yeah cars vary a little bit and some of them of course they actually come out of the dashboard and stuff like that so you know but there you go guys um i'll leave all the links below for it a uh, big thank you to quiscent for sending it out for review um and i will carry on using it because i absolutely uh love this sort of stuff you know it uh you know sometimes i do long journeys and i need to use the phone as a sat nav or something like that so well worth having something like this guys so big thanks to quiscent leave all the links below and i'll see you guys in the next one cheers guys see you